magnetohydrodynamic effect, also called MHD. The magnetic hydrodynamic effect is not something you need to know about in high school, but it's a nice physics phenomena and you can practice your left hand skills with them. Remember, F, B and I. Uh, what you see here is water with road salt, which is a little bit dirty. That's what you see. You see some plastic particles floating around in there. It's just to show the flow. You see two metal bars and they're both made of brass. You see a strong magnet. Uh, the top of that is north and the bottom is south. And you see a power supply, which is here, 24 volts DC, and it can go up to uh, 5 amps. Okay, now I switch on electrics again. And when you look in between, you can see the current. Small particles running up and down. See that? See easily, yeah? So. What if I take away the magnet? The current is slowing down and will come to a stop. I need the magnet for this current. So put the magnet back in. And there the flow goes again. Very clearly. Now please pause this movie and first try applying the left hand rule yourself. The index finger represents magnet field and should point down, north to south. The middle finger represents current and should point towards you. So the remaining finger, the thumb, rep representing Lorentz force, should now point right, which is the direction of the flow. That can be no coincidence.